Hi, welcome to CapeCast. I'm Connie Barron, Public Information Director for the City of Cape Coral, Florida. Here is your three-minute news update for the week of April 13, 2015. The final presentation on the Bimini Basin Project will be Thursday on April 23rd at the Faith Presbyterian Church from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. The public will get presentations from the University of South Florida planning team. They'll be talking about three concepts, threading the needle, bridging the gap, and canal works. They'll be taking some more input and they'll be putting together a final plan. Now you can find more out on the Bimini Basin page on our website, www.capecoral.net under special projects. Well, we're moving into the second phase of our bicycle education program and our efforts have been focusing so far just on education. Cape PD has made contact with more than 200 motorists and almost 100 pedestrians and more than 300 cyclists talking about the rules of the road. Now our next phase will be enforcement, which means repeat offenders could get a ticket. So why are we doing this? Well, bicycle fatalities are a concern here in the state of Florida and Lee County is third in the state for fatalities. We've seen an increase in crashes, 50% in hit and runs, and Florida drivers, face it, are just scary bad. So we need to be careful when we're out there on the road. You can get more information at our capecoralbikeped.org webpage. There's lots of information there. Road paving is on the way. We have some money in the budget that council will be taking a look at. We're looking to put a 1.8 million toward local roads and 850,000 to major roads. We have a million dollars for the five-year paving plan. Five of that will go in the northwest and five of that will go into the southeast. That's how many miles are get paved. We still have no decision on the fire service assessment, which means that future capital projects could be in a little bit of a little bit of trouble here. We're six months into the fiscal year budget, so we may have to take another look at it. Cape PD received their certification from CALEA, the Commission on the Accreditation for Law Enforcement Agency. It's their eighth accreditation. We've been accredited since 1989, and it's a comprehensive assessment. We get an, uh, an award of excellence, which means Cape Coral PD is the best of the best. Congratulations to our 25-year employees. Todd Rigoni and Rob Topoleski with our fire department. They were part of the class of 1990. 1990. Congratulations. Three-minute news update. See you next time.